is like the best kind of scenario uh, for like local Youngstown contractors. A big shortage of Section 8 units in Youngstown that they have a waiting line of over 500 people with vouchers trying to get properties that they cannot get. Remove a bunch of stuff out of the backyard, including but not limited to the half torn apart slash half scrapped apart car and or truck, whatever this monstrosity used to be. Yo, landlords, we need more properties, right? We will pay you well. We will treat you good. Give us more housing for these 500 tenants, man. Welcome to Investment Properties sales show folks thing is selling at or above list we are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education we take you to the video tour won't watch to be giving it to you straight big time opportunity in youngstown ohio folks big time opportunity if you have what it takes if you're willing to put in the work because this particular property it's not going to come to you without work, right? 399 West Warren Ave, Youngstown. 349 for a duplex. It's going to be able to bring in 1870 in rent. But again, cannot stress this enough. You don't get to buy it for 349 if you don't need to put in some serious work. And you got to put in some serious work. As you can see, any and everything that needs to be done to this duplex needs to be done to this duplex, man. She, she done messed up, man. She's been beat down, okay? She's uh, going to need a little bit of everything. Not only do you need to go in and do new kitchens, new baths, new hot water tanks, new furnace, uh, new drywalling, etc., you also need to uh, remove a bunch of stuff out of the backyard, including but not limited to the half torn apart slash half scrapped apart car and or truck, whatever this monstrosity used to be. It's like so uh, taken apart that uh, I can barely even tell what it is right now. Bonus points to somebody who could tell me the make and model of this vehicle. Put that in the comments, you dirty freaks. But anywho, who really gives a shit about that stupid-ass car? We ain't talking about stupid-ass broken-down cars right now. We are talking about cash flow investing, folks. Now, this property, it's it's got a lot of opportunity Again, if you're willing to do the work, right? You got to do the work. If you think real estate investing and making serious money is like this easy thing, you're in the wrong business, man. It's not. But if you can put in the work, if you have the ability to do renovations, like this particular property, guys, th this is like the best kind of scenario uh, for like local Youngstown contractors, investors like that, right? Like guys or gals that uh, they themselves have their own construction company, their own crew, right? People that can get in there and they can do the work themselves, right? Like if you're a contractor yourself, you can get the work done a lot cheaper than if you had to pay like a third-party company to come in, right? If you had to pay a third-party company to come in here, I mean, you're looking at like a freaking $60,000 renovation, right? But if you have your own crew and your own skill and you could do things on your own, you could end up all into this sucker, end up all into a duplex, with almost $1,900 a month coming in and rent for a very low price, right? And the fact that it's in Youngstown is great because Section 8 duplexes in Youngstown, boy, woo, you're going to get a ton of money, right? They are literally lining up uh, for Section 8 housing in Youngstown, right? I was chatting with uh, one of my colleagues down there, okay? He's telling me that there is literally – such a big shortage of Section 8 units in Youngstown that they have a waiting line of over 500 people with vouchers trying to get properties that they cannot get, right? Like Section 8 was literally telling people, right, through their, their housing authority, they were like literally like, yo, landlords, we need more properties, right? We will pay you well. We will treat you good. Give us more housing, for these 500 tenants, man, we need people, right? So if you're out there and you have the ability to put together properties, folks, you could get yourself a solid bird deal, something of that nature, because they are going to be so profitable down the line because you have a line of tenants, right? So your vacancy, folks, is probably going to be next to nil when you have this many people trying to get Section 8 housing. If you had to wait in line with 500 other people and you finally get yourself a renovate apartment, do you really think you're going to be moving? They ain't got nowhere to move in Youngstown, right? So if you guys had the ability to come in 
Utilize the burst strategy. Utilize sweat equity. Build up your own portfolio of distressed housing in uh, Youngstown through that process, through the process of fixing up housing that is not currently in the Section 8 program and putting it in the Section 8 program. You're going to get yourself a friggin' portfolio with next to no vacancy because there ain't nowhere for the tenants to go, y'all. And if you've watched Holton Lies TV for any amount of time, folks, I tell you the biggest return killer is your turnover, right? We make the most money. Yeah, we're going to get a ton of rent because they're paying landlords really well down there right now. But on top of that, probably more important than that, we're going to get so much money, so much cash flow because of the fact that we're able to keep butts in our units, right? Turnover, especially Section 8 turnover, right? Go ahead and watch the Tenants from Hell show, guys. Like, if you think you're renting to a bunch of Section 8 tenants and you're having them move out, like, every year or two, they're going to fuck your house up, right? That's just how the game is played, all right? It's got pros and it's got cons. If you really learn how to play the game and really take advantage of opportunities that are available to you, opportunities that are presented to you like this one, you'll see that the best way to do it is to go to an area where there's more Section 8 tenants than housing because they have nowhere to go. There's not going to be turnover. You're not going to deal with the big return killer, which is cleaning up after these people fuck your house up. That's how you play the game. That's how you become rich with Section 8 investing. And I think this particular property, again, really good for people who have the ability to do the rehab themselves. You really save some money there, right? You'll be able to utilize your skill set to make the big bucks, right? So if you guys... Want to invest in this property? Send an offer to my team, sales at holtonwise.com. Include your proof of funds plus how much you want to offer. If before you want to make that offer, because obviously it's cash as is offers only, right? The house is all fucked up. Uh, if before you make that offer, you want to physically tour the property, the video isn't enough evidence for you to put together your scope of work, not a problem. Shoot us an email, sales at holdandwise.com. We will set you up for a free tour today. We'll get you in there. Very easy to show this thing. We will get you in there so you can put together all your numbers and then present us the offer. Again, sales at holdandwise.com. Let's go. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.